Well, joining us now is Kevin LaChapelle, a former El Cajon police officer. Thank you for being here. First of all, let's go back to that picture just released by El Cajon PD. It's the moment of the shooting. Uh, what does this shed on the whole situation? What light do we now see? Well, this just tells a huge piece of the story because this supports what the police, what the chief said, that this person took something and pointed it at the officer. In that picture, I think any reasonable officer would clearly feel that their life is in danger to have something pointed at them. Uh, such as that. Um, and I think this is exactly why it's important for the community to let these investigations play out. Because if you remember the protesters, everybody was saying, first was with their hands up and this and that. This clearly shows something very contrary to that. And Elko and PD is very transparent and fairly quick tonight to get that out. They've been very transparent. I'm curious when you look at this, I mean, that officer pretty close to that man right there. Is that pro part of normal protocol? I mean, to, to be that close? Well, it's hard to know what, we, what was going on specifically, but um, when somebody pulls something out very, very quickly, you have a very quick notice of, you know, what, what are they doing and is this going to threaten my life? So I think this really is going to support what the officers are saying. Uh, on the other hand, the community, again, there's obviously still uh, challenges and opportunities across the country with building relationships with the community, but the community has to realize when behaviors like this occur in the presence of police officers, they have to realize how completely inappropriate that is. Now, on the other side, you have a person with a mental illness. It's probably things that could have been done a lot sooner to mitigate these things before it spills out into a street somewhere, like seeing symptoms and having them get the help that they need from the family. So much bigger conversation ahead. Absolutely. Clearly. And an investigation ahead. Thank yes. you, Kevin LaChapelle, for your expertise sure. tonight.